Chris Akar Ramesh with Pipes and Tobacco, and here we're sitting with? Uh, Ted Swartin. Um, we're going to be talking about smokingpipes.com. So your website may be one of the biggest success stories in the world of pipes. Um, would you give us a little bit on the history of your site? Okay. Uh, Sykes Wolford founded smokingpipes.com in 2000. Uh, he founded it in a uh, college dorm room in Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, saw an opportunity. The pipe market was growing. A lot of young guys were getting into pipe smoking. 15 years later, we're the uh, largest online retailer for premium pipe and pipe tobacco products. That's very cool. Um, so which, which uh, college in Tennessee? Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt, okay. Very nice. Um, how many packages per day do you typically ship? It varies. Uh, we're retail, so it's a little seasonal. Um, we're candy seasonal. Mm -hmm. You know, we pick up from all the holidays. Um, I'd say anywhere between 300 and 500. Wow. Okay, so pretty, pretty full shipments there. Yeah, pretty full Have shipments. Full. We've got a lot of people working in shipping. Um, a lot. That's great. Um, now, now, which parts of the world account for the majority of those waters? It's mostly domestic. We, okay. we have international business. Uh, yeah. That is probably 20 to 25 percent of our, our total business is international. Right. Right. So it's domestic. Oh, great. Um, and predominantly, which is there like a region well, that that you get more orders typically? Just I think you know, the country generally is pretty well served. I don't I don't know that there's a there's a region. I mean, there are probably more shops in the northeast and the west coast than there are uh, in the midwest or north. Okay. Um, but uh, we have such a selection. We have a bigger selection than any brick and mortar store could ever hope to carry. That. You know, if you want to look at a big selection of pipes and pipe tobacco, you sort of have to go to sort of pipes. So I don't, I don't think there's a particular region in the U.S. that, okay. that you know, can serve better than that. Okay. Um, so how many pipe makers do you represent and could you name it? Uh, we represent around 70 different pipe makers. Not just pipe makers, we have you know, artisan pipe makers, which is you know, like one guy working in a shop. And uh, then there are more like pipe factories and a bunch of people working on different processes and different stages of making pipe. Uh, so, you know, Savinelli, Peterson, Chacon, uh, their pipe factories that we deal with, and the distributors, they send us pipes. Uh, then there are artisans like uh, 60 percent Tom L. Tate, J. Allen Pipes, and Davidson. You seem to be adding new pipe makers to your lineup all the time. Is it challenging to find them? Well, I don't. I don't think we're adding new pipe makers to our website. We're really careful about who we bring into the fold. Um, we have a responsibility we feel to uh, the hobby to make sure that um, the pipes that we are selling to our customers are, are not just unique, uh, but well made and, and um, you know, quality. It's, it's a, a lengthy vetting process before we introduce a new pipe maker to the website. Okay. Uh, sometimes it can take years and years of, of working with the pipe maker before mm -hmm. we decide that they're ready for, to be on smokingpipes.com. Right. Um, we've just got really high standards. Um, so, yeah, we're, we're, we're not adding all the time, but we do add, you know, a handful of marks every year. That's good, fair. Good to know. That's good fair. To know. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, do, so when we're talking about these pipe makers, do they typically approach you, and do you help young pipe makers achieve skill levels appropriate to selling on your site? Um, it's it's some some of both. Uh, we'll have uh, pipe makers that uh, want to be represented on SmokingPipes.com. They get into the, the hobby. They, they want to make a business for themselves making pipes. And I think that part of their success means 
is being on a website like SmokingBulls.com, so we can have people reaching out to us so that we can represent them. Um, but we also will be talking to the pipe maker, and he'll say, oh, there's this guy over here that we really need to talk to, because he's really good, mm -hmm. and so we'll sort of chase them, you know, we really want you to be on SmokingPipes.com, yeah. so some, some of both. And we, uh, we do work with pipe makers, but someone who's only been doing it for two or three or maybe five or six years, um, you know, independently, uh, we'll, we'll talk with them, we'll say, oh, we really like what you're doing here, what if you tried doing this? Yeah. Uh, Sykes and uh, Jeff Grasick, um, Jeff Grasick, J. Allen Pipes, mm -hmm. uh, he's been doing a, a seminar for the last couple of years uh, at his home in San Diego, California. Um, where he's getting all these pipe makers together so that we can sort of collaborate and develop their skills as a, yeah. as a collective. And uh, we've been involved in that. Sykes has gone uh, both times uh, and has been involved in that. And I think they're going to continue to do that. And the, the pipe makers are all really good about working with one another. Oh, that's they're great. They're a very supportive, uh, collaborative group. That's wonderful. Yeah, I guess I guess new because that's a smaller hobby lifestyle kind of thing. Yeah, you mean you think that in, in another industry they'd all be competitors and they'd all hate each other's guts yeah. and they wouldn't want to share secrets and work with one another. But I, I think here everyone in this hobby, in this industry, everyone knows that and feels that you know, we're all helping each other and, and putting making better pipes and putting better work into the market. And yeah. It's better for the consumer, it's better for everyone. Absolutely. That's, uh, that's wonderful to hear that. Um, so kind of the last question to wrap this up, um, how much tobacco do you ship and what about accessories? Uh, how much tobacco do we ship? Uh, tons, literally tons, <laughs> tons of tobacco. Okay. Not yeah. figuratively, like tons and tons of tobacco. Um, and accessories, uh, we have a pretty a long tail of accessories in our, in our category. Um, I, Cleaners, different brands of pipe cleaners, leather goods, pouches, stands, cabinets, tobacco jars. Yeah, you know, all kinds of knickknacks. Yeah. All kinds of knickknacks. Great. Well, thank you so much for your time. Yeah, it's my and pleasure. please go check out smokingpipes.com and tune in to Pipes and Tobacco for the extended version of our Thank you.